Okay, an update on my uh, <clears throat> hydroponic experiment here. You probably notice I, I I took a lot of the leaves off. Might have been a mistake, but uh, I still got all this up here. But what it what what it is the reason I done all this? I really screwed up by putting these tomatoes in here anyway because they <laughs> they've got so big. I should have known better. But uh, what happened is. My, uh, I've got some peppers down the garden, and they took some kind of blight. And uh, I don't think I won't have no peppers this year unless I get them out of this, because I've got, I've got peppers here. I'm fixing, the, I'm fixing to pick these right now, by the way. But anyway, uh, I've got these peppers, and um, there's a big huge one there, and look at these banana peppers. Oh, uh, there's there's like one huge one like that and right there and um, and I'm going to pick those and those there but uh, that was the reason that I uh, I cut all that out was to give more light for those peppers um, so they're not going to have any in the garden I've got plenty of tomatoes so if these live I mean I believe they'll live I don't think I really hurt nothing I might have kept a leaf or something right over top of that, but I believe everything will be good. But anyway, it opened it up and gave it a lot of air. And um, like I say, this was just an experiment anyway. Next time I'll know not to put no big uh, like Mr. Stripies or something like that in there or tomatoes at all, really, in the summertime. But I tell you, this thing really does good with peppers. Um, oh, and by the way, it uh, talk about drinking water. That thing drinks. I mean, that's. Um, let's see. I forget now how big a container that is. It's um, well, it's 20 liters. I don't know how many uh, gallons that is right off the bat, but it's 20 liters, and it. Uh, it drinks eight liters of water a day, so uh, that's four. That's uh, two gallon. So it drinks uh, two gallons of water a day, and it's really eating the nutrients up too now. But I guess it's feeding a whole lot. But uh, it uh, <laughs> it kind of looks funny now since I've cut all that out. But but uh, I did want to save my pepper plants, and that's the reason I done it. And uh, next year, uh, uh, I'll, I'll probably do the same thing, but just won't put no tomatoes in there because tomatoes just took it. I mean, it was just like a like a jungle in there, more or less. So anyway, that's uh, that's about it for right now on the on the hydroponics.